Welcome to a journey into the unknown. Today, we're diving deep into the cosmos where the mysteries of black holes await us. These celestial bodies, or rather these celestial mysteries, have been subject to intense scrutiny and countless theories. From being cosmic vacuum cleaners to potential gateways to other universes, black holes have always been a fascinating subject for scientists, astrophysicists, and curious minds alike. In this episode, we'll explore the top 10 theories about black holes that have intrigued and baffled the scientific community. Whether you're a science enthusiast or just a curious explorer, this journey is sure to spark your imagination. So, buckle up because we're about to embark on a voyage like no other. Stay tuned as we reveal which theory takes the coveted number one spot. Trust us, you won't want to miss this. Have you ever pondered the mysteries of black holes, those cosmic abysses that defy our understanding of physics? These celestial behemoths, cloaked in darkness, are some of the most enigmatic phenomena in the universe. Their very existence challenges the boundaries of what we know about astrophysics. Black holes are regions of space-time where gravity's pull is so strong that nothing, not even light, can escape their grasp. They're like cosmic vacuum cleaners, sucking in everything that dares to come too close. But what's inside these cosmic monsters? What makes up their structure? This is a question that has puzzled scientists for generations. Various theories have been proposed, each more intriguing than the last. From the idea that they're simply bottomless pits to the possibility that they could be gateways to other universes. Today we're embarking on a journey into the heart of these mysteries. Join us now as we dive into the top 10 theories about the structure of black holes. At number 10 we have the no hair theorem, a rather peculiar name for a theory, don't you think? This intriguing concept posits that black holes can be characterized by only three properties, their mass, charge, and angular momentum. In other words, black holes have no distinguishing hair, as it were. Imagine a universe where all cats, regardless of breed or color, are simply referred to as cats. No Maine Coons, no Siamese, no Persians, just cats. That's essentially what the no hair theorem suggests about black holes. So. What does this mean for our understanding of these cosmic enigmas? It implies that black holes could be much simpler than we initially thought. They're not the cosmic chameleons we once believed them to be, changing and adapting to their environment. Instead, they're more like cosmic constants, unchanging and unyielding, distinguished only by their mass, charge, and angular momentum. This theory suggests that black holes are much simpler than we might think. Coming in at number 9, we delve into the heart of the black hole, the singularity. This is where the magic, or rather the mystery, happens. The singularity is a point in the black hole where density becomes infinite, and space-time as we understand it, breaks down. Imagine packing an entire star into a space so tiny it's practically a single point. That's what we're talking about here. The laws of physics? Well, they take a backseat at the singularity. It's like the universe's very own Bermuda Triangle, where our understanding of reality just vanishes. The singularity is the ultimate breakdown of our physical laws, a place where the fabric of the universe stretches to its limit. And what happens beyond that limit, we're still figuring that out. The singularity, a point of infinite mystery at the heart of a black hole. Theory number eight introduces the weird and wonderful world of quantum mechanics into the mix. When we venture into the realm of the incredibly tiny, things start to behave in ways that seem, well, strange to our everyday experiences. One such peculiarity is quantum entanglement. Imagine two particles being inextricably linked, no matter how far apart they are, the state of one immediately influences the other, even if they're at opposite ends of the universe. Now imagine a particle pair at the event horizon of a black hole. One falls in, the other escapes. This is the essence of the concept known as Hawking radiation. Stephen Hawking, the brilliant physicist, proposed that black holes aren't entirely black. Instead, they emit radiation due to quantum effects near the event horizon. This radiation, known as Hawking radiation, implies that black holes can slowly lose energy or mass over time. This is a radical departure from the traditional view of black holes as all-consuming gravitational monsters. But how does this influence the structure and behavior of black holes? Well, if Hawking radiation is real, it means black holes can shrink and even eventually evaporate completely. This process is incredibly slow for large black holes, taking more time than the current age of the universe. However, for tiny black holes, it could be a fireworks show, ending in a final dramatic explosion. 
Quantum mechanics also provides a potential solution to the information paradox. This is the question of what happens to information about the state of particles that fall into a black hole. Does it disappear forever, violating principles of quantum mechanics? Or is it somehow preserved? Quantum entanglement might offer a way for this information to escape, even from the clutches of a black hole. So there you have it, the quantum perspective offers a different fascinating view on black holes. From Hawking radiation to the information paradox, it's clear that when quantum mechanics meets black holes, things get seriously interesting. Quantum mechanics and black holes a mind-bending combination? At number 7, we explore the concept of quantum loop gravity. This intriguing framework seeks to unify two of the most influential theories in physics. Quantum mechanics, which describes the behavior of particles on a microscopic scale, and general relativity, which governs the large-scale structure of the universe. Quantum loop gravity, or QLG, is a theoretical attempt to reconcile these two theories. It's like trying to merge the rules of a chess game with those of checkers, but in the realm of physics. It's a complex task, but if successful, it could provide an unprecedented understanding of the universe's structure and function. In the context of black holes, QLG could potentially provide an explanation for their mysterious interiors. For decades, black holes have been considered regions of space-time where gravity is so strong that nothing, not even light, can escape. But QLG posits a different perspective. It suggests that, instead of being a point of infinite density, the singularity at the center of a black hole could instead be a quantum state of space-time itself, a scenario that avoids the infinities and paradoxes of classical singularity theories. What does this mean? Well, in simple terms, it implies that black holes might not be the all-consuming inescapable monsters we've often depicted them as. Instead, they could be regions where space-time is in a unique quantum state, a state that might even allow for the existence of a whole new universe within. Though quantum loop gravity is still a theory in its infancy, it's a promising one. It could potentially solve some of the biggest riddles in cosmology such as the nature of black holes and the very origin of the universe itself. It's a theory that challenges our understanding of the cosmos, pushing the boundaries of our knowledge and daring us to imagine a reality beyond our current comprehension. Quantum loop gravity, a theory that might just bridge the gap between the large and the small. And who knows? Maybe it will also help us better understand the enigmatic, fascinating entities that are black holes. The universe is full of mysteries and every theory brings us one step closer to unraveling them. Now prepare for a wild concept at number 6, black holes as holograms. Let's step into the realm of the holographic principle. This far-out theory dares to suggest that all the information inside a black hole is encoded on its event horizon. Yes, you heard it right. Rather than being a three-dimensional object, a black hole might be a two-dimensional hologram of sorts. How does this work, you may ask? Well, let's imagine a memory stick. When you store information on it, the stick doesn't get heavier, right? According to the holographic principle, black holes function in a similar way. The information doesn't increase the three-dimensional volume, but rather the two-dimensional surface area of the event horizon. So, in essence, the black hole's interior might just be a holographic projection of what's on its surface. This idea is not just whimsical speculation, it comes from string theory, a branch of theoretical physics that seeks to reconcile quantum mechanics and general relativity. In string theory, the fundamental building blocks of the universe aren't particles, but tiny vibrating strings. And these strings could potentially encode the information inside a black hole on its event horizon, just like a 2D hologram. Now if this theory holds up, it could have profound implications. It could challenge our understanding of space and time and force us to rethink the nature of reality itself. Are we living in a three-dimensional universe or is everything around us just a complex hologram? Bear in mind though that this is just a theory. It's a fascinating idea, but we're still a long way from proving it. We need more research, more data, and more understanding of the universe's deepest mysteries. But isn't that what makes science so exciting? It's a never-ending journey of discovery, a quest to unravel the secrets of the cosmos. And who knows? Maybe one day we'll find out that black holes are indeed holograms, and our perception of reality will be forever changed. Black holes as holograms, a theory that challenges our perception of reality. At halfway point number five, we have a theory that sounds straight out of a science fiction movie. 
wormholes. Imagine if black holes, those mysterious cosmic entities, could function as shortcuts through space-time. This is the essence of our fifth theory, wormholes. The idea is that black holes could be gateways linking two distant points in the universe like a cosmic shortcut. But how would this work? Well, just as a tunnel through a mountain saves you from going over it, a wormhole could theoretically save you from having to travel all the way across the universe. The journey through a wormhole would be drastically shorter than the conventional path, potentially bending the rules of time and space as we know them. But remember, this is purely speculative. We've yet to observe a wormhole, and the existence of such a phenomenon remains unproven. Nevertheless, it's an exciting concept that fuels our scientific curiosity and our imaginations. Wormholes, a tantalizing theory that could change the way we view the universe. Uh, coming in at number four, we have the theory of black holes as dark matter. Now here's a thought to rattle your brain. What if black holes, these enigmatic entities swallowing everything that comes their way, were actually a form of dark matter? Yes, that elusive substance making up about 85% of the universe, yet remaining unseen and largely unknown. This theory suggests that black holes could be primordial, born shortly after the Big Bang, and not just the product of collapsing stars. These primordial black holes, scattered throughout the cosmos, could make up the dark matter we've been trying to pin down. It's a tantalizing idea, linking two of the greatest mysteries of our universe, black holes and dark matter. Of course, like all theories, this one is subject to ongoing research and debate. But isn't that the beauty of science? It keeps us on our toes, forever in pursuit of understanding the cosmos. Black holes and dark matter, a cosmic mystery wrapped in another mystery. At number three, we have the theory of black holes as information vaults. Imagine a black hole as a giant cosmic library, securing every bit of information it swallows. This concept is deeply rooted in the black hole information paradox. Here's a quick primer. The paradox stems from the conflict between quantum mechanics and the theory of general relativity. According to quantum mechanics, information can never be lost, while general relativity suggests that anything that plunges into a black hole is lost forever. This clash of theories gave birth to the idea of black holes as cosmic information vaults. So, how does this work? Think of every particle of matter that a black hole devours. Each particle carries certain characteristics, its mass, charge, spin, and so forth. The crux of the theory is that a black hole preserves this information rather than obliterating it. This may seem counterintuitive. After all, black holes are notorious for their destructive power, not their preservation skills. However, the theory suggests that the information is not stored inside the black hole as one might store documents in a safe. Instead, the data is encoded into the event horizon, the boundary around a black hole from which nothing can escape. This encoding process is akin to creating a hologram. The information becomes a two-dimensional representation on the surface of the event horizon rather than existing in a three-dimensional form. Interestingly, the theory of black holes as information vaults also offers a potential solution to the black hole information paradox. If the information is stored in the event horizon, it might not be lost even when the black hole eventually evaporates due to Hawking radiation, but like all theories, this one has its skeptics. Critics argue that the encoding process would require mechanisms that are not yet understood. It's a fascinating debate, one that pushes the boundaries of our understanding of the universe. Black holes, potentially the ultimate information vaults of the universe. At number two, we have the fiery firewall paradox. Imagine, if you will, a wall of fire waiting just beyond the event horizon of a black hole. This isn't just any fire, but a theoretical wall of energy dubbed the firewall. This controversial theory challenges the notion of smooth space-time beyond the event horizon, as postulated by Einstein's theory of general relativity. Instead, the firewall paradox suggests that anyone unfortunate enough to fall into a black hole would be incinerated by this high-energy zone, a rather dramatic end. But why a firewall? The concept arises from attempts to reconcile quantum mechanics with gravity. It's a proposed solution to the so-called information paradox in black holes, a problem concerning the fate of information about particles that fall into a black hole. So, could a fiery wall of energy be the last thing you see before being swallowed by a black hole? The jury's still out on this one. The firewall paradox, a fiery debate in the world of black hole theories. And finally, at number one, we have a theory that takes us beyond our universe, the multiverse theory. 
This theory suggests that black holes could be portals to other universes or dimensions, a concept that has fascinated scientists and science fiction writers alike for decades. Picture this, a black hole not as a destructive force but as a cosmic gateway. The multiverse theory proposes that our universe is just one of many potentially infinite universes. Imagine a vast cosmic network with black holes serving as connecting links. In this model, when a star collapses into a black hole, it could potentially birth a new universe on the other side. It's a theory that challenges our understanding of black holes and indeed the nature of reality itself. As with all theories, it's still under intense scrutiny and debate. But one thing is certain. If it holds up, it could revolutionize our understanding of the cosmos. The multiverse theory, a theory that truly expands our horizons. We've journeyed through a cosmic labyrinth of theories about the structure of black holes. From the Nohair theorem's simple yet profound assertion that a black hole can be defined by just three parameters, to the mind-bending idea of black holes as holograms, we've delved into some of the most intriguing hypotheses about these cosmic enigmas. We touched on the singularity, where our understanding of physics breaks down, and the quantum loop gravity that seeks to bridge the gap between quantum mechanics and general relativity. We considered black holes as potential dark matter and as information vaults, and explored the tantalizing theories of wormholes and the multiverse. Each theory, in its unique way, attempts to unravel the mysteries of black holes, offering us glimpses into the unknown. As we continue our cosmic journey, let's keep questioning, learning, and exploring these celestial wonders. Remember, in the world of astrophysics, the journey is just as important as the destination. Until next time, keep looking up. Before we wrap up our cosmic journey, we'd love to hear from you. Did you learn something new from this video? Which theory about black holes intrigued you the most? Were you amazed by the concept of black holes as information vaults, or did the firewall paradox spark your curiosity? Perhaps the idea of black holes as dark matter or the multiverse theory left you pondering? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to give this video a like if you enjoyed our journey through the enigma of black holes. Share it with your friends and family and invite them into this fascinating journey through the cosmos. And if you haven't already, do subscribe to our channel and hit that bell icon. We regularly delve into the mysteries of the universe and we'd love for you to join us on these explorations. Until our next cosmic journey, keep looking up and stay curious.